fab. Today's video is going to be a little update on the old Mark II Escort. Um, just got a couple of little bits I've been given to um, get bolted on. Stuart from um, Magnum Car Panels was chatting to him at the NEC. I said there was a couple of little bits I needed for the just to, just to finish this off. I uh, didn't have any bumper brackets. This is just held on with the two side bolts, so they they remanufacture these, which just replace the original ones. So we can uh, get those bolted on and fix the bumper properly. They're quite nice little laser cut brackets with uh, like a, what do you call that coating? Nickel, nickel plating, I think. And then these, something that you can probably see is missing from the car. New, uh, what is that? Yeah. Yeah. so we've got some new reproduction chrome wing mirrors. These are really hard to find if you're trying to get like second hand ones, almost impossible to find now for the escorts. Um, I'd actually bought some random ones off a Triumph or something uh, to fit on there, but one of them got broke, so uh, i got these. Got a banner to go up. So we'll stick that up on the wall as well. So yeah, we got on this side, we've got a uh, some damage. This obviously had some huge mirror thing put on it and it's probably been whacked and sort of bent all this about and there's a load of filler in here so um, we need to clean all this off, weld these holes up and then re-drill it where it wants to be and then I'll make like a backing plate cutting out on the plasma table that will go in behind it to like sandwich it all together and stop it from buckling that if you ever hit it. I got a little uh, trick if you want to measure uh, center to center of two bolts. Stick the verniers onto one of the bolts so you got the width of the bolt. Zero it there. 
So I'm zeroed at the width of one bolt and then measure outside to outside 37.85 and then that's giving you your bang on like centers of the holes or you can do inside edge to outside edge but that's harder to get accurate like that it's much easier to go outside to outside after zero in the uh, six mil for that so uh, I can't even remember what that was now 37.85 so 38 now really check the other ones the same that one's bang on 38 So it's a little backing plate for the to sit on the inside of the door, just like to support it on the back, so the whole mirror is not pulling on the um, like one mil door panel. So these need to be quite a bit further back and a bit higher than uh, the original one was, because if it's back here. You can't see it. Um, I think that's to do with these. Uh, this car's got the folding out windows, so this piece of uh, like rubber trim comes up much higher than normally. The window goes all the way down to here. That uh, plate behind has actually pulled that really nice and flat. The bumper brackets fit really nice. Alright, that's all I've got for this one. Um, bumper brackets fit really nicely. Mirrors look exactly the same as the originals. So yeah, happy with that. Thanks again uh, Stuart from Magnum for um, sending me those out, it's much appreciated.
If you need some mirrors or some bumper brackets or basically any panel for any old Ford or pretty much any panel for any old car or anything really, you might Magnum do them all. So if you need any of that stuff, link in the description. Go and have a look. See if they got what you need. The mongrel sat there looking a bit sorry for itself. I've made a decision on, on, on that um, and I've decided I'm, I'm going to just do the whole process myself. Uh, I'm going to do all, all the filler work, um, everything, painting, top coating, I'm just going to do it all myself. Uh, read a lot of the comments and that seems to be what people want to see and I think it's what I should have done from the start really, um, which I had. So as soon as the um, as soon as the stuff turns up for that, I will be uh, getting cracking with it. That is all I've got for this one. Cheers for watching. See you on the next one.